Hello, my lovelies, and today I'm going to talk to you about middle school and why it sucked. And this is something that I think most people, you know, don't understand because lots of people, you know, in movies and shows always assume that high school sucks, that high school is the be all and end all of sucking, and that that's where you get bullied and that's where people are cliquish and all that sort of stuff. That's a lie. The real answer is middle school. I had a hellish time from 7th through 9th grade, because those were my middle school years, because 9th grade was in the middle school for some reason. But um, I had a hellish time. It was, it was horrible. Uh, I was bullied physically and uh, verbally, which I dealt with, I mean seriously. Um, in 7th grade I made a couple of attempts I, like, I was tempted to make a couple of attempts on my life. I never did, because I think suicide is weak. Um, and, I mean, it was terrible. People people are not just cliquish, but they will go out of their way to pick on you. In high school, people know who do that. Uh, so that's one really thing, thing that's uh, not seen in movies and in TV and that people don't talk about is in high school, you're not like people don't click on uh, don't pick on you if you're in a group you stay within that group people generally leave you alone and if someone within that group has animosity towards you then yeah they're going to be a little bit of, a little bit you know rah they're going to pick on you they're going to be mean to you but at the same time it's not like it's rival clicks because that doesn't happen in real life however in middle school no one has quite solidified themselves in the social structure yet. So you have um, people who are huge dorks and don't understand that they're dorks and therefore don't understand that they should be hanging out with the dorks. And I know that it's kind of, you know, it's a, it, I'm going to get picked on for saying stuff like that, like dorks should hang out with dorks, because, I mean, I'm not saying that people should, you know, separate themselves from each other based upon, you know, what they, what they are and that we should label people, but people self-segregate. I am a nerd. I hang out with nerds. I don't hang out with other people. I don't hang out with stoners. I don't hang out with uh, tanning girls. I don't hang out with the gym crowd. I don't. I hang out with nerds because they're the people I enjoy being around. I don't get picked on any more than I would like to get picked on in that group. Yeah, some of my friends, you know, jokingly will make fun of each other, but, but we all do that. That's something that you can do when you're comfortable within a group. But when you're in middle school, you don't know your place, so there are, uh, everyone is, uh, everyone hates everyone else. Even if you're friends, everyone hates everyone else. And you don't solidify yourself until ninth or 10th grade. 10th grade, I noticed when I got to the high school, I mean, no one was picking on me. Everything was happy, no one was, uh, was mean to me, unless, um, well actually no, no one was mean to me. 10th grade was a good place, but I had three years where everyone was mean to me where I had rocks thrown at me, where, you know, people would tell me on a daily basis that I was, you know, all these sorts of bad things. Uh, and I, I, I mean, I was a dork. I wore glasses. I still do. I have asthma. I, um, I like nerdy things. But when you get to the high school level, people no longer pick on you for that because they no longer have to socialize with you. When you get to high school, you start to pick your own classes, you self-segregate into the higher level math classes, the higher level English classes. If you want to be an art geek, you're an art geek and you're in those classes. People stop having to interact with each other and that's really what it is. And that's why there's less bullying in the workplace when you have a, a career that is a specialized career. Um, why in college, when you're in your major, you usually don't have that much problem with other people unless you, you know, there's one person who everyone hates. Um, but when you're in middle school and when you're in elementary school, elementary school you're still a little bit young to be bullying. Bullies in my elementary school were, we had one or two, but they were fairly rare. When you get to middle school, everyone's a bully. Uh, because no one likes anyone else and no one likes themselves. Because you're in the middle of a lot of changes, you don't understand who you are, you don't understand what's acceptable in the world, and so you think that everyone's going to hate you, so you lash out. That's what happens. And, um, so I just wanted to talk about my middle school experience, how sucky it was, and how I think that people should stop saying high school is the place for bullying and start understanding that uh, it really happens younger. This is Brigida signing out.